Hey y'all, it's Vanity Diana. Welcome back to another video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. So as you can see by the title, today we're trying Starbucks holiday drinks. And I'm excited because for one, I love Starbucks. And a lot of these drinks that I see on the holiday menu, I've actually never tried any of these drinks. So y'all get my first impression and my real raw uncut review. I'm going to be honest with y'all. And I'm going to let y'all know what drinks y'all should go try for the holidays. So... Let's place our order. So first we're gonna start with the hot drinks. They have the peppermint hot chocolate, the peppermint white hot chocolate, and the toasted white hot chocolate. And that looks like all the holiday edition hot drinks. Okay, so they also have steamers, but I don't think I'm gonna get a steamer. I've never had that, but I just prefer not to try that today, but we'll probably try it, you know, in between vlogmas. But, okay. So for the hot chocolates, I'm going to get the peppermint hot chocolate. I'm going to try the peppermint white hot chocolate. And we're going to get the small size in those. Okay, so that's it for the hot drinks. And then I'm going to go to Frappuccinos next. So they have the pumpkin spice frappuccino, the apple crisp oat milk frappuccino, the peppermint mocha frappuccino, and the peppermint white chocolate mocha. Also the caramel brulee frappuccino, the mocha cookie crumble frappuccino, the chestnut praline frappuccino, the sugar cookie almond milk, and the toasted white chocolate mocha frappuccino. So that looks like all of the holiday frappuccinos. And I think I'm going to go with hmm. I think I'm going to go with the sugar cookie almond milk frappuccino. So let's add that. Something makes me want to add a caramel wall to this because I usually add a caramel wall to my frappuccinos. So that's what we're going to do. Add caramel drizzle into water. Okay, so we're going to go to the um, iced coffees first because I don't know if I want two iced coffees or two frappuccinos or if I want to mix it up. So let's go to the cold coffees next. Okay. So the iced lattes. They have the iced pumpkin spice latte, the iced caramel brulee latte, the iced chestnut praline latte, the iced sugar cookie almond milk latte, and that looks like it's about it for the um, ice lattes. So, we're going to look at the ice mochas next. They have the ice white chocolate mocha, the ice peppermint mocha, the ice peppermint white chocolate mocha, the ice toasted white chocolate mocha, and the ice ca cafe mocha. Okay, I don't know if that's one considered a holiday, but... I think we're going to get a, hmm, I don't know if I want the iced peppermint white chocolate mocha or the iced toasted white chocolate mocha. I think I'm going to go with the iced toasted white mocha. Oh, I did not mean to make that a grande. Okay, so we got one more drink to order. So let me look back at the cold coffees and see. Hmm. I think I'm gonna try the iced peppermint white chocolate mocha. Let's see what that's about. I'm gonna make that a tall. 
Add to order. Now let's go to the bakery section. And I'm going to try the reindeer cake pop. Okay, it's a vanilla cake interior with chocolate icing filled with a festive red nose and antlers. Add that to the order. Then we're going to look at the snowman cookie. Okay, a buttery shortbread snowman cookie dressed up in white chocolatey icing. I'm going to add that to the order. That's real cute. Okay, so... It looks like we got all of the items that we're going to try. So yeah, y'all see my total is $33.32. Never spent that much at Starbucks in my life. But for y'all, we're going to do it. We ordered our drinks, so we're about to get ready to pick them up. But they'll be ready at 12.51. So we got a little wait, but we got seven items. I feel like when you order a drink from Starbucks, you have to actually know what you want for it to be good. So I'm kind of nervous because, I don't know. The original drinks, I usually literally add stuff that I want to my drinks. And so today I didn't really do that besides, did I add the caramel drizzle to the, um, I think I did to the Frappuccino. Besides that, I just got everything how it comes. But if you know, you know. When you order in Starbucks, you got to know what you want for it to taste good. If you go there and say, oh, I want an iced coffee. A caramel iced coffee. You may be the type to like your iced coffee a little sweeter. So you got to ask for, you know, your extra pumps or whatever. But, you know, some people don't know that. And some people just say, Starbucks nasty. No, you don't know how to order your Starbucks. That's the problem. Service and cordial. My name is Haley. What can I get started for you? Hey, I placed the order online. Okay, what was the name on that? Vanaya. All right, you can go forward. Well, there you go, and I gotta get another drink for you. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. <laughs> there you go. Thank How many shots did you need? Um, I needed five. Can you give me one more? One more? Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. Can I get some napkins? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Have a good one. You too. All right, y'all. We got our drinks. I'm about to park somewhere. So first, I need to take a picture of my drinks before, before the thumbnail, before we try them. I kind of want to take a picture with the drinks. Let me see if I can. Okay, hopefully I can get a good thumbnail out of that. Hold on. Okay, that should be good. Let me get a picture of the cookies. The cookie actually a different color than it was online. This is what it's like being an influencer, y'all. Trying to be a content creator, trying to be an influencer. Getting good pictures. Hmm. 
Okay, so that should be good pictures of the um, cookies. So this is the ice toasted white mocha. This is the first drink we're trying. This is good. This is good. Mmm. I really like this. I like this, y'all. So I would give the iced toasted white mocha an 8 out of 10. This is good. Okay, let's move on. So, next is the iced caramel brulee latte. Straw, so we're gonna mix the flavors. I picked some good options today. I actually like this one better than the first one. So I'm going to give this one a 9. Again, this is the Iced Caramel Brulee Latte. If you like a sweet coffee, this is good. Like It's not too sweet, but you can taste the caramel. If you like caramel, you'll like this one. Mm. Okay. Okay, let's try something hot now. I can't tell which one this is. It looks like it's the white, the white hot chocolate. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. This has peppermint in it. And it's actually good. I was kind of scared about the peppermint, y'all, because I really don't. I mean, I like peppermints. They're okay, but, like, that's not something I'm just going to go eat. But this is actually good. I think they gave me a. Okay, yeah, this is a peppermint white hot chocolate. I like this. I would definitely go get it again. I rate this. If you like peppermint. I rated it an 8 out of 10. Okay. We don't have no bad reviews yet. It's crazy. I didn't think I was going to be too crazy about the peppermint. I feel like your stomach would be hurting though. I'm not going to lie. With the peppermint and the sweetness. But this is the, the peppermint hot chocolate. So this is regular chocolate. Why does the regular chocolate taste better than the white chocolate? I'm surprised because like I said, I like a white chocolate over chocolate, but that peppermint and the regular chocolate mix is good. So I rate that one a 10. That's a 10 out of 10, y'all. The peppermint hot chocolate, y'all, I'm shocked. And then next, this is the sugar cookie almond milk frappuccino. This is good. It tastes just like a sugar cookie. It's crazy how they got these flavors down pat. Mm. Starbucks did not disappoint. Y'all, I recommend literally all of these. I'm going to rate them from the best to my least favorite. Let me get one more sip of this. Okay, y'all, I picked some good drinks today. And I thought the first one was good, but now that I drunk the other ones, the first one is probably the, the last one. 
okay so let me rate let me rate so for number one we're gonna go with the peppermint hot chocolate this is my favorite drink today so 10 out of 10 like I said y'all should go try that and then the sugar cookie almond milk frappuccino next on the list this is good so if I would have to say like between hot drinks the um, peppermint hot chocolate would be number one for the hot drinks the cold drinks I would say the sugar cookie almond milk frappuccino would be number one for those mm. and then next I would say let me try this again and see Like my stomach gonna be hurting trying all these drinks. Hmm. I feel like it's kind of different. I don't know. I don't know which one go first. I think I'm gonna say that this one is next, just because I love iced coffee. So I'm gonna say this one is next up, which is the iced caramel brulee latte. And then I'm going to say the peppermint white hot chocolate is after that one. So four. And then last but not least, the ice toasted white mocha will be the last one out of all these drinks, which I'm shocked. Because when I tasted this one, I'm like, mm, it's good. But when you taste the other ones, I'm just in shock. I'm happy though because all of them were good so I didn't waste my money and we spent a good bit at Starbucks today but at least we won't get them points so next is the um reindeer cake pop we will try this it's supposed to be vanilla cake inside oh I feel like I need some water y'all I just had a lot of sweet stuff but If I like this, is this supposed to look undone? Because it's giving undone. I don't really get cake pops from Starbucks, so I don't know if this is right or not. But y'all let me know. It may, it look kind of it look like it's done on the camera, but it don't taste done. It tastes like too moist. Maybe this is how cake pop supposed to taste. But I'm going to rate that a 6 out of 10. I don't even know if it's a 6. It might be like a 4. Let me take a little bite again. know about that y'all I need some water I got a bottle of water in my trunk but next we're trying the snowman cookie this is real cute can y'all see y'all see the little um, sugar at the bottom that's cute that little snow I hope this one is good so let's try it I'm gonna bite from the top and the bottom since they got different stuff on it This cookie is good. It's good. It tastes exactly how they explained it. Like the buttery. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Okay. I like this. If y'all like like icing cookies, y'all should try this. I actually like this. I will finish this. Not all at once though. It's a lot of sugar. Okay. So I'm sure y'all know I do not like the cake pop. So I wouldn't recommend the cake pop, but I don't know what I'm supposed to compare it to. I think I've had um a cake pop from Starbucks before, but like I can't really remember what it's supposed to taste like. But I feel like that tastes undone. So mm -mm. would not would not recommend or would not try again. But everything else we got, all these drinks we got, I would definitely try again. This is my favorite cold one. Mm. It's crazy because it really tastes like a sugar cookie. I think that's why I really like it. Yeah, my camera had cut off. But like I was saying, this is definitely my favorite. So make sure y'all go get this one. gonna be the end of this video y'all try to make sure I drink a little bit so I can get my money's worth that's the end of this video I hope y'all enjoyed make sure you like comment and subscribe and don't forget to comment down below some of your favorite Starbucks drinks they don't have to be holiday edition it could be any drink that you like from Starbucks make sure I comment those down below so I could try them and if y'all try the drinks that I just tried let me know let me know how y'all like them in the comments and like this video if y'all want a part two you can also comment if you want a part two I really enjoyed doing this video because I loved all of the drinks which I can't believe but that's good I said like I said Starbucks is good I love Starbucks but if you want to see more make sure you like comment and subscribe and I'll see y'all in the next video